Hello everyone. Hey, hey, this is a little bit of a holiday special for me. I don't know if it's a holiday for everybody, but uh, in the U.S. And I just thought I'd go live here for a little bit. I'm also going to do um, and join another musician or songwriter on a TikTok battle today. So you guys get to listen in on that or watch if you want. <clears throat> well, come on in. Thanks so much for joining. Not sure if my regular crowd is here. Hey, greetings, Thailand. I was on uh, a live stream last night, my time, and I had uh, a few people from Thailand join, so that was really neat. I will follow here because uh, so neat to see people from all over the world. This is a song called Vincent. Uh, it's by Don McLean. It is uh, called Starry, Starry Night, uh, like this painting that I have behind me. Uh, I'm just going to kick off things here with this song. Hope you enjoy. And uh, again, I'll be doing a little bit of singing, and I'll be doing a little battle, so stick around. We'll have some fun. I'm part of an uh, amazing TikTok group here. <laughs> Sounds good? Hope it sounds good. All right. Bienvenido, Guatemala. Muy bien. Okay. Vale. <clears throat> Estuve en Perú por dos años. Uh, hace casi 20 años, pero ya yeah, me gustaba mucho uh, estar en Perú. Y hacer servicio y uh, algunas cosas. Uh, okay. Let's see. All right. Here we go. Um, starry, starry night. Starry, starry night Paint your palette blue and gray Look out on a summer's day With eyes that know the darkness in my soul Shadows on the hills Catch the trees and the daffodils Catch the breeze and the winter chills In colors on the snowy linen land Now I understand What you tried to say to me And how you suffered for your sanity And how you tried to set them free they would not listen, they did not know how Perhaps they'll listen now Starry, starry night Flaming flowers that brightly blaze Swirling clouds in violet haze Reflecting Vincent's eyes of china blue Colors changing hue Morning fields of amber green, weathered faces lined in pain, are soothed beneath the artist's loving hand. Now I understand what you tried to say to me, and how you suffered for your sanity, and how you tried to set them free. They would not listen, they did not know how Perhaps they'll listen now Starry, starry night Guys, uh, thank you so much. That's an abbreviated version. I'm going to do a live here um, and a battle, so enjoy. Let me try to uh, get her in. I don't want her to wait around. So cool with the Van Gogh in the background. This was a song by Don McLean. You know what? I might do a reprise here when we get on here um, with Hannah. So, here we go. Hey, Justin. Hey. How are Hello. you? I'm good. I got the full um, setup over here like I do for my normal streams. I was just uh, getting one song in before you joined. No worries. What was <laughs> the song? Sorry. Yeah. Uh, I was doing Vincent, um, Starry Starry Night by... Um, 
uh, Don McLean. I don't know. Oh, it's nice. Inspired here by this picture, Starry, Starry Night. Uh, was Don that the, was the song actually inspired by that? Yeah, I mean, uh, his life story. Um, so Don McLean was a writer, what, in the 60s and early 70s, um, songwriter. Now, this song probably came out in the early 70s. That's where most of my music goes. And you are oh. a songwriter. I have watched some of your lives before. You have? Oh my gosh, that yeah. makes me so happy. Yes, yeah, I am. Um, actually, I'm amazed at what you can do on the fly like that. Oh, thank you. So you saw the thing where I um, wrote with the people who were on the stream. Yes, yeah, like you had a board and everything, and um, or like some sort of uh, dry erase board. Or it was, else then I realized that yeah. everything is backwards through the camera, and I was like, okay, <laughs> this was a valiant oh, yeah. effort. <laughs> Yeah, that's awesome. Well, really, really neat. So tell me um, about yourself here. We've got uh, quite a few people on. Amazing. Joined, uh, Let me throw you the battle thing because I know. Oh, that's a match. OK, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Got it. No worries. Yeah, we do need to start them out. I know that's true. So for um, anybody who's new, um, just the battle will be. I think you can do likes on the screen on your side or my side and then um, gifts and things like that make the points go up and down so absolutely everybody this is wins. just all in good fun it's yeah. all in good fun yeah yeah um so, so yeah tell me about yourself um by the way is the bossa nova too loud i kind of threw it on and i was like i actually cannot oh i can hear it a little bit okay we just wanted a little bossa nova bossa nova in the okay. morning always a plus got it um, so I'm a, so right now I'm doing my nails because I'm going to a shoot directly after this. Okay. I promise I'm not just always streaming me painting my nails, oh, but my good views. exactly. I'm a, <laughs> uh, I'm a songwriter, a uh, content creator and a songwriting rights activist. So I work with a group called 100 percenters and we fight for songwriter, engineer, producer, artist rights, better treatment, oh. that kind of thing, uh, which is now very important. Now I get important. all your posts on there. Now I understand. Yes. So um, I think a couple of years, I've been writing music for 23 years, uh, but officially since 2013, I had a big old ugly cry. Oh, thank you. Just survival, surviving. Um, I think like literally uh, two years ago, I was watching the Grammys and I just mm -hmm. started ugly crying because I realized mm -hmm. there's no category for songwriter of the year. Um, it's pretty much like there's no producer of the year. There is uh, artist of the year. There's song of the year, but there's no category specifically for songwriter of the year. And there are some songwriters who are heavy hitters who write for everybody. Mm -hmm. And so thank you so much, Just Surviving. Um, yeah, so it's just like one of those things where I was like, you know what? I'm not going to allow myself to ugly cry over this anymore unless I'm trying to actively make it a better space for creatives. Uh, because if you guys are familiar with the situation going on right now, uh, Spotify, a lot of the DSPs, a lot of the streaming services, they've mm -hmm. been trying to pay less on publishing, which is the only thing that the songwriter makes money on. Um, and right now, if you mm -hmm. own the entire song publishing, which almost never happens unless you produce, wrote, perform the song all on your own. Um, there's so many politics that go into it, but you're only getting 0. 0.0004 cents per stream. Right. Yep. Um, so if you had a hundred million plays on a song on Spotify, uh, and you own a third of the publishing, you would only make six, six thousand dollars, which is not sustainable. Like if you think about how much an average person earns per year, and if you had only a hundred million plays, it's a lot of plays. Goodness it's goodness. a lot of plays. So yeah, to have a, a song that hits that is amazing. So the fact that you're not going to have that many songs that get to that point. So it's just like, it's a very broken system. So that's what I do. I am an active writer and I'm also somebody who is trying to make it a better space for the next eight year old who wants to go into music. I like the yeah. volume down. Too little loud for me. <laughs> yeah. You can turn down everybody's Alexa by that. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> everyone. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> My headphones are on. We're good. Well, that's really neat. I, um, yeah, we're part of a, a group here um, with TikTok, and I think that having the songwriters and the music people together is a really neat idea because um, it gets me able to meet some people. I have written a few of my originals. Um, I love that. As kind Tell of me about like your music. Singer, singer songwriter stuff. You know what? I might play one for you. Um, yeah. I know it'll, it should not disrupt your. Uh, Alexa, your off. mood too much here, your music. <laughs> no, it's totally uh, This is my very latest one was a song called Honest With Myself. But 
Uh, I will tell you the music that I cover, that 60s and 70s, actually late 60s, early 70s, was the advent of the singer-songwriter, right? I mean, that's mm -hmm. where James Taylor, Carol uh, King. John Denver, Carol King, exactly. Um, so that's Carol King's song um, James Taylor did, You've Got a Friend. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I do a lot of James Taylor stuff. Um, I actually, actually took classes from his brother, Livingston. No way. Yeah. What kind of classes? What are we talking about? Um, so I, uh, by the way, just, uh, just surviving. Thank you. I appreciate your love and support. You're great. Um, oh, all these people are awesome on here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, so I went to Berklee College of Music in Boston. And I want to hear okay. your music. I didn't want to look interrupt or anything. I just got excited <laughs> I when I heard a Taylor I in there. Just, I was like, yeah. yes. Just picking around. Yeah, but like, no, I uh, I went to Berkeley College of Music. Let me give a little screenshot here. Congratulations on your win. Oh, thank you. I got some. Let nice me throw another one here. up there. We're doing another match, guys. So, new chance. You absolutely whooped me, but like, let's see what happens round two. Hey, that's okay. <laughs> it's all, all open for round two. I've got exactly. some amazing supporters on here, but tell me oh, more. Um, okay. School um, of Music in Boston, you said. Was... Yes. So, I went to Berkeley College of Music in Boston. Um, mm -hmm. And amazing teachers. I think my favorite part was just being a 18 year old surrounded by incredible writers and producers and art. Like I, I could literally pick like five people on my dorm floor and have this insane band that and like 20 wild. minutes, like who gets to have that experience? It's so lovely. Surrounded by musicians and amazing artists. Wow. Yes. Um, but I, yeah, I feel extremely lucky, uh, to have had that experience. I think, you know, and I think, but you probably, oh, thank you, Mikey. I think you probably can agree. The best part about music is the opportunity to collaborate and like pull ideas out of each other and be vulnerable with a new person and write something really authentic. Yeah. Uh, that's really so nice. that was, that was really cool to like be able to be in that opportunity, you know, coming mm -hmm. from Georgia where like wow. sports were king and there were people who were into music, but to go into a place where everyone like lived breathe eight music was just so cool hmm. but i want to hear some of your music well so i i did marry someone who went to the school of music in uh, north carolina there's a place called um, east carolina used university and they have a school of music probably the only one in the state um that is you know well known but i was kind of always on the fringes and uh you know picked up guitar just for fun way back when but I did write several songs when it's something hit me or when something inspired me. Mm -hmm. And I would just, you know, this last one was written, it's called Honest With Myself and it flowed and it felt good. It was what you do on your live streams probably, um, where you're just writing and, and choosing and, and going in a direction and it all just kind of works out. And that's amazing magic. Um, I love that. Yeah, this one was written at the very end of last year. It was. It's on uh, all streaming services. I go through DistroKid is my oh, own, yeah. you know, personal one to put out there. And my son is a uh, he writes songs also. The, these guys have grown up watching me kind of play and and now get myself out there a bit more on TikTok. But um, they are just like on the shoulders of giants here, where it's <laughs> they are leaps and bounds. My kid, oldest kid, is uh, 16 and he writes like a new song every other day. I don't know. That's so he, great. It's he uses his garage band and he does his lyrics and he uses some of their loops, but he's now on ukulele and doing other stuff. So I'll have I to send that. you some of his stuff. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. All right. So my song here, I will play for you. Um, Honest with Myself is about, well, this has many different meanings. One of them is about people who just do not speak up or speak their mind and they kind of silently suffer. Of course, and yes. I watched some situations uh, by people close to me and my extended family and go through some really hard times for just not speaking up and being too afraid. Well, and real quick shout out to Sassy Sarah on here on my list and Stacy, you guys are awesome. Oh, Love it. Uh, well, and my sister's on, looks like too, so plenty of people. Um, Love. This is honest with myself. A lot of people on my side, I think, have heard this song. Here we go. I 
It's been too long since I said what I'm feeling Perhaps a lifetime ago Looked in the mirror and I saw I needed healing I've got a long way to go But how can I ever hope to know The part of me that I will never show Freedom will come from the tip of my tongue If I'm honest with myself I hid behind my words And I hid behind my silence I was afraid to let it out I lived a life of resentment and violence With my head full of doubt how can I ever hope to know The part of me that I will never show And freedom will come from the tip of my tongue If I'm honest with myself It's hard when I feel so alone Just the beat of my heart and this song and if I open, then I might break Guess that's the chance I have to take Cause how can I ever hope to know The part of me that I will never show And freedom will come from the tip of my tongue If I'm honest with myself when I'm honest with myself I'll be honest with myself Woo! Whoa, thank you. For some reason my nerves kicked in. I'm think I'm performing no. this for an actual songwriter here. <laughs> That's really that funny. That was so good. Oh, you got a lot of love on this end, by the way. Oh, thank you so much, Mikey guys. Mikey said, Mikey's this another big awesome. musician. And Mikey said, oh. ooh, I needed to hear this song today. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. Ducky said he's so good. A bunch well, of times. Ducky's you know, a big fan. Lyrics are so touching and relatable from just surviving. And truly, they are. I yeah. also wanted to harmonize. You don't understand. I was like biting the inside <laughs> of my cheeks. I'm like, you can't harmonize with him because there's a lag. The to lag throw is his tough. performance off. And it's not about you, Hannah. <laughs> hey, well, I will have to put out like some sort of um, one where you can you can duet or something. I'll duet we'll, with you anytime. We'll do it. yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful oh, melodies. So but, I mean, like. I can definitely tell you were inspired by uh, the, the great words. songwriters of the 70s and James Taylor, especially. Very James Taylor. Energy. Definitely. Yep. Um, Paul Simon. So Simon and Garfunkel, like a lot of the picking and stuff that I do and their, their writing, Paul Simon's. I've been listening to a book um, or an audio book called Miracle and Wonder. Um, mm -hmm. It's a Paul Simon book. Just came out. And um, Malcolm Gladwell wrote it. He's a great oh, cool. uh, writer. Anyways, they do like audio interviews, like hours and hours and hours, and they put like 10 hours into this audio book about singer songwriter, you know, Paul Simon. All right, I got my screenshot, I, I think, of that one. Did you yes, I got okay. both of them. You Perfect. won this battle. I know we have to do one more, oh, but this okay. is just all for fun. Um, <laughs> yeah, this is fun. Yeah. This is fun. I love that. Um, so I feel really lucky because one thing, I mean, that I was able to get with my education is I got to see like uh, Paul Simon play live. Actually, my graduation mm -hmm. you know how like they have graduation speakers what i will yeah. say i kind of won the lottery when it came to like graduation speakers because my year we had three amazing graduation speakers i think you'll appreciate this uh annie lennox oh wow uh willie nelson no way and carol king hallelujah they came <laughs> to the school uh, well, that's a special place. I mean, James Taylor was in there, and I don't remember where Carol King was for, but um, from or where she would reside most of the time. But um, that was Boston was like James Taylor's spot. For oh, him. yeah. I think that he grew they, up here in North him Carolina. Him and his brother grew there, up, but, yeah, like, or spent yeah. a lot of time there. <clears throat> they did, um, right after like graduating high school. 
and I mean, they're also lovely. And Carol King gave me like two mm. hugs, and I was like, "Please give my aunt Carol. Like, could you oh, please be my, my Carol?" Oh my word! You are spoiled here. That's really. <laughs> it was neat. like I think I this the first one or the the second one was because like you're walking across the street, stage to get the like, diploma and everything. Yeah. And you got the hug. Uh, but like, and there was one moment I was just like looking at her, like probably like had this like look of like, "Oh my God, is Carol King?" And she was just, like, "You're so sweet." <laughs> like, yeah. Man. <laughs> that is that's really a unique experience wow definitely yeah didn't oh that where where i'm at and we had another person who wasn't even invited he just showed up very rock star uh billy nelson's very good friend chris christopherson oh wow yeah. who was literally yeah. like just showed up because he could and he was like i'm just gonna be here too <laughs> i mean they're buddies that's great that's amazing here's the willie song in yes, that's the, the twilight glow I see Blue eyes crying in the rain Very well Very well When we kiss night and part I knew we'd never meet again Know yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Could I get some crazy, some Patsy Cline? Oh wow, man! Patsy if you don't Klein, know that one, that's okay. I just well, it was in my head earlier. I'll do a piece of it because Patsy Cline was like my dad's favorite female artist growing up. I mean, I go walking after midnight, all the ones, and then I think the story on that crazy song was. Oh yeah. He I wrote that in like ten minutes or something and sold it like or gave it away basically for a very. For a bar tab. Amount. Oh my word. So the story and I heard song. was it was sold for a bar tab and the contract was on a cocktail napkin. <laughs> oh, I'm glad he, I guess, later sang it himself <laughs> and uh, maybe got some from that. Wow, crazy. Okay, yeah. Oh, Let me just look this one up because I do I a few. Fun. I will just on the fly. I know. But we I love know it right away. If, I don't, um, I don't slaughter songs, so I'll stop in the middle if I've, I've killed it. <laughs> Fair enough. But that's the fun thing about music, right? Like, sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't, but it's still an expression. <laughs> exactly. Oh, I think we could do this one. Crazy. Crazy for feeling so lonely. I'm crazy, crazy for feeling so blue. I would cape up this up, actually, just a little bit. I'm going to cape up. I was going to say, it sounds like, <laughs> hey nice, like really hitting your low register. Maybe uh, it is pretty good. I would just a little tiny bit. <laughs> now the second part of this. My love me as long as you wanted and then someday you leave me for somebody new worry why do I let myself worry wondering what in the world did I do a mix between Willie and Patsy. <laughs> I would love to uh, kind of do this at the the way she can do this. You want to sing it? I'll give you a delay. <laughs> it would be That's better with work. the female voice. I totally know why Patsy Klein sang this. Oh, she is. Mm -hmm. I'll give you one chord. You sing it. Mm -hmm. I'll follow your lead. Wait, you want to follow mine okay. or am I following you? How does this work? No, the I'm gonna, I'll. Yeah, we'll be a little delayed overall, but here it goes. So the first one. <laughs> is this a um, good key? Crazy. Yeah. Easy 
grateful feelings so lonely and I'm crazy grateful feeling so blue I know I actually realized I don't know the words here <laughs> Be as long as you want to be. I someday, someday, leave me for somebody. Beautiful voice, and I can hear it coming through. We should totally do something together. I think we should totally. Yes. I would love to. Like, I could put out an instrumental on that one. Totally. I'll just get it a little bit. I'm not sure how it is. Pick it or strum Put it. out like a lead or a harmony, and then I would do edit. Yeah. Easy, cool. or maybe a little classic, something like that. Easy. Well, that is so good. I know you. I do not want to keep you up for. You know, it's totally you, fine. Like, I so I found out my but... call time was late. Like I literally a uh, okay an hour ago. I thought my call time was at ten. My call time is at noon. So I'm gonna like probably right. go for a run, but I might hang out on live for a little bit more. But I want you to be able to get back to your concert because I know your thing is that you're playing songs. <laughs> yeah, I'm so I don't wanna... people. But yeah. this was a pleasure. Let's do it soon. And yeah. gorgeous voice. Love your original song. So fantastic. That was really a cool moment for me to be able to play that for a, a songwriter. I've never been able to do that so you know what though you, you might time. be surprised you might be surprised justin because yeah. sometimes i've been on here and like really big songwriters have randomly popped on who i don't know from adam I'm like oh, artists wow. and then i'll like awesome. look at their thing i'm like oh you've got like you know a million followers nice. and that's so yeah. insane so you never know no, 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 no. for all you know you've been playing the big rock yeah. stars and you absolutely kill it there you go. Well, this has been a pleasure, pleasure. Really good meeting you. And how do I pronounce your last name? Is it Avison or? Yes, you got it right. Usually people try to make Avison. it like, first okay. of all, everyone always thinks I've uh, like done something creative, like Hannah Vision. Yeah. And I'm like, no. I actually I looked at that and that's what I thought. <laughs> or they're yeah, like, Avison, they want to make mistake. it French, like a vision. It's just right. Hannah Avison. Oh. But thank you for getting it right. Okay. I appreciate Perfect. that. Thank you for asking. Yeah, no problem. Well, I well, hope you do well in your, you said it's an audition or something coming up. You're no, so I it? am the spokesperson for this Whole Foods CBD brand. So oh. we're just going into shoots okay. today. We're just filming oh, neat. basically some like kind of like product videos. So it'll be fun. Wow. So cool. And you are based in on Los Angeles. Coast. Yeah. I yes. It was LA. Okay. Awesome. LA. <laughs> well, have so a good. great one. So good to All see right. you. Bye. Yeah, nice meeting you. Bye. Well, guys, thanks. That was really interesting. I don't never know what to expect here, but I've um, put myself out there in TikTok a little bit. And I was like, I'm going to be part of this group, which is kind of making things happen for creators on TikTok. And uh, that's one of the things that comes from that was meeting that uh, person, Hannah. So she's a songwriter. Amazing. Okay, that was a special moment for me to sing my original song. I'm going to do Mr. Bojangles. We didn't get to play this one last night, and I just saw somebody requested it. So, thanks. Oh, wow, I see my regulars on here. Scooby Snacks, Zany, I saw Peter. Vladimir, welcome. I take it you are from Russia here. I see some Russian writing in there. <laughs> or somewhere I don't actually know exactly, but I'm guessing. Okay, thank you so much, Kathy. Good to see you on here. Andrea, okay, I get a bit of a different crowd, but a lot of the same people are on. Hopefully you guys are either working and uh, I'm on in the background or you're having the day off and you're having a good time. This is Mr. Bojangles. Hope you enjoy. Touchdown. 
had a man to sell in New Orleans I was Down and out It looked to me to be the eyes of age As he spoke right out He talked of love Talked of love Left picked his heels and stepped. He said his name Bojangles and he danced a leg across the cell. He grabbed his pants and spread his stance so he jumped so high. Then he clicked his heels. He let go of life. Let go of life. Shook back his clothes all around Mr. Bo James Mr. Bo James Mr. Bo James Through those in menstrual shows and county fairs Throughout the South He spoke through tears of 15 years How his dog and him Traveled about The dog up and died Up and died After 20 years he still breathes Said a dance now at every chance and honky tonks for drinks and tips. But most of the time I spend behind these county bars. Cause I drink a bit. Shook his head, and as he shook his head, I heard someone ask him, please. Mr. Bo James, Mr. Bo James, Mr. Bo James, friends. Well, I saw my people out there today walking shadows on jerry is on all right and hopefully um a few new people out here james welcome to the show this show is an abbreviated show <laughs> thanks uh, we we even had um oh nearly 50 new followers here i was going live we've only been on for about 30 minutes um or less and uh i was again we just did a live battle and thank you guys so much for the support I know um, I just am amazed at all the love and uh, for people coming out and listening and supporting even during, during this, some weird, some battles on there. <laughs> but I had a singer, no, yeah, I mean, she was a singer also, I, obviously a musician, um, went to school of music here at Berkeley and in Boston, and then... Um, she's a songwriter and really neat. I got to perform an original Honest With Myself for the songwriter. People in the industry, that's really neat. Maybe open some doors here. Well, I'm not sure if I have time for one more song, so hold on one second. Hey, Tiffany. Yeah. Is it time to go? Okay. Oh, I got 15 minutes more. Kitchen pass here. We got to go somewhere afterwards, but I got 15 minutes. So what are we going to do with these 15 minutes? Am I on Spotify? Yes, I am. You can ask, say, Alexa, play music by Justin Burnett. Play an acoustic song by Justin Burnett. Oh, okay. Yeah, she'll do acoustic songs. Oh, there's my song. We're honest with myself. Alexa, stop. 
<laughs> so um, that is, uh, I do have a few originals on there. Um, not so many, um, but now I've just come to the conclusion that I am able to post some covers uh, that I do, which I do all these wonderful covers. And I love these oldies, and um, man, they mean so much to me. They mean so much to my parents also. I've sung these songs and learned a lot that they love also. And they're like, well, I just want to listen to it on stream, you know, anywhere I'm at, in the car or wherever else, on my uh, on Amazon Music or on Apple Music or on Spotify. And I was like, well, I can't do that. Uh, <laughs> but now I guess I can. I can actually post my uh, covers on there, which is really TikTok everybody the support on here un unlocking musical doors for me um, we've had 7,000 people on in these 30 minutes and uh, I'm gonna look through the list here and just I do not know goodbye girl and she's saving it Jerry is taking these requests and putting them on a big list so that when I get some time I get to listen to these and uh, try them out um, I'm just gonna look over a list that I've been working on and look through here if there were any other um, requests Guys, go check out Walking Shadow 51. Archie McDonald just joined. And check out Saxo Piet. Both of these guys are musicians on here who um, really need. Mr. Big, please, just to be next, to be with you. Hmm. Good evening in Poland. This is Joanna. All right, all right. So good to see you on here. Guys, I just, uh, well, I think one of my YouTube videos, TikTok Lives, is going to post on YouTube in the next 30 minutes, so you can watch that when I leave. <clears throat> oh, nice. Okay, a Paul Simon song. Um, Moon River, what a cool request. Okay, I actually do have a couple by Paul Simon that were, you know, ones he did after he left the group. So if that's what you're looking for. I mean, I do all sorts of uh, Paul Simon. I mean, Simon and Garfunkel. Actually, they're all Simon, Paul Simon songs. <laughs> but, uh... I'm sitting in a railway station Got a ticket for my destination On a tour of one night stands My suitcase and guitar And every stop is neatly planned For a poet and one man band Homeward bound Wish I was Homeward bound Home where my thoughts escape their home Where my music's playing home where my love life's waiting silent song uh, I mean Paul Simon the writer and creator of all, all that music and Art Garfunkel amazing harmonies throughout those guys grew up together in the Bronx area um, of New York amazing duo uh, this is the song he wrote afterwards um, when they split up apparently Art Garfunkel was spending a little bit of time in movies and it was hard to get according to Paul Simon um, get some of his time <clears throat> and they, they just went kind of separate ways. Uh, but I do Sound of Silence and so many others. If you check out my profile page or subscribe on YouTube, you will see a lot of these. I did a full version of Sound of Silence with a friend. Um, I've done it with my group. This one is called Slip Sliding Away. Let's try this one. <clears throat> Slip sliding away. You guys know this song. Slip sliding away. You know the near your destination, the more you slip sliding away. I know a man. He came from my hometown. He wore his passion for a love like a thorn of ground. He said, Dolores, I live in fear. My love for you is so overpowering, I'm afraid that I would disappear. Slip sliding away, slip sliding. 
getting away You know the near your destination The more you slip sliding away And I know a woman Became a wife These are the very words she uses to describe her life She said a good day Ain't got no rain She said a bad day's when I lie in bed I think of things that might have been Slip side and away Slip slide no way You know the near your destination The more you slip slide and away I know a father who had a son He longed to tell him all the reasons for the things he'd done He came a long way Just to explain He kissed his boy as he lay sleeping Then he turned around and headed home again He slipped sliding away Slipped sliding away you know the dear your destination, the more you slip sliding and away. And God only knows, God makes his plans. The information's unavailable to the mortal man. We're working our jobs. Collect our pain Believe we're gliding on the highway When in fact we're slip sliding away Slip sliding away Slip sliding away You know the nearer your destination The more you slip sliding away Slip sliding away Slip sliding away Nothing near your destination The more you slip sliding away Thank you guys Oh, I've not done that song uh, any time on here, I don't think So really neat to sing that one Oh man, you guys are requesting some good songs <laughs> uh, Leader of the band Wait, I said I would do these Tuesday, I think This is a beautiful song by Dan Fogelberg. Let me see if I got what it takes today. And I do have five minutes, so hmm. let's try it. Oh, man, there's so many good ones on here. Hold on. Sister Golden here was here sitting on the dock of the bay. Oh, 50 Ways to Leave Your Lover. Oh, man. I'm going to do a snippet of Leader of the Band, and I'll try uh, 50 Ways to Leave Your Lover because that might be interesting to try. All right, so here's a snippet. Leader of the Band. Beautiful song. Child alone and while a cabinet maker's son Hands were meant for different work And his heart was known to none Left his home and went his own In solitary way He gave to me a gift I know I never can repay Quiet man of music denied a simpler fate. He tried to be a soldier once, but his music couldn't wait. He earned his love through discipline, a thundering velvet hand. His gentle means of sculpted songs took me years to understand. Leader of the band is time and his eyes are growing old But his blood runs through my instrument And his song is in my soul Life has been a poor attempt Imitation 
tape man I am just a living legacy to the leader of the band beautiful song man he's got such a range on there 50 ways here we go last song I think this is it <clears throat> all right so glad you like that I'll take that Margo, good, thank you so much. Peter, thank you. Jacko. Sugar Man, I'll have to look that up. Mm -hmm -hmm. Loved it. Scooby Snacks, thanks so much. Really appreciate that. New Kid in Town. Oh boy, I've got a lot to learn. <laughs> My list is so big, and I feel like I know a decent amount of songs, but there's always new ones <laughs> for me. I say, the problem is all inside your head, she said to me. The answer is easy if you take it logically. I'd like to help you in your struggle to be free. There must be 50 ways to leave your lover. She said, it's really not my habit to intrude. Furthermore, I hope my meaning won't be lost or misconstrued. So I repeat myself. At the risk of being rude, there must be 50 ways to leave your lover. 50 ways to leave your lover. Just slip out the back jack, make a new plan, stand. No need to be coy, Roy. Just get yourself free. Hop on the bus, cuz don't need a sky smile. Stop all to keep and leave and get yourself free. All right. Wow, I've never played this one or sung it, so this is uh, really cool. She said, it grieves me, son, that I have to leave right now. I think there's someone else who can play for you, or you can go watch my YouTube live, that's a, or YouTube streams, <laughs> some recordings. I'd like to help you. No, let's see. I'd like to stay and play some music for you. I'll come back tomorrow night at 9 p.m. <laughs> Eastern. So I hope you can join back then. Uh, I wish I could play some more. I think I'm going to get the uh, goodbye to ready to go. Um, here's some dust in the wind. Here's some bloom, paper kites. Let's see. Oh, wow. Okay, no, I really gotta go. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, there we go.
All right, guys, I'll leave you with that. Some beautiful chords on there. I think this is beautiful. Well, that's kind of leaving us out there if I do that. Ready? Okay, we're ready, guys. It's been a pleasure. Thanks so much. Yep, I do need to leave. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great one. Bye. All right. Appreciate it. And thanks for helping me win the battles. You guys are so cool. Bye.